Hello children, how are you all? Okay, fine. Children, what we learned in previous class? Yes, we learned in previous class place values, right? Tens and ones. Can I ask some numbers? Are you ready? Now, children, what is that number? Yes, number 6. Number 6, is that single digit or double digit? Yes, 6 number is a single digit, right? And 22, here 22, right? 22 number is a single digit or double digit? Yes, double digit. Why? Because here we have two numbers. 2 and 2. Right? And one more number. 45. Number 45. Right, children? Number 45 is that single digit or double digit? Yes. Double digit. Otherwise, Two digit. Okay, children? See, four and five. We have two numbers, right? So, we call this one two digit number. Otherwise, double digit numbers. Okay. Where we mention ones and tens. For example, first we will take six number. 6 is the single digit, right? So, where you mention 1s or 10s? Yes, 1s. 1s. Why? 6 is a single digit. And children, be careful. When we mention place values, we are starting from right side. Okay? Don't go to left side. Starting from right side. Okay, children? Then, here, number 22. 22. See, this number where? Here, here. Yes. This number, here. And one more number. Now, tell me, this two is a ones place and one more two, tens place. Why? Because this is two digit number. Right? And one more number. Number 45. Now, children, see. First number always ones. And second number tens. Right? Why? Because we are starting from right side only. So, 5 going to ones place. And 4 tens place. Okay, children? This is very, very important. Okay, children? Got it? Now, children, already we discussed about big numbers and small numbers. Last classes, right? Also, in UKG, you can learn already, right? Okay. Children, here, from 1 to 20, numbers are here. Okay? Now, number 3, I circled and number 7, I circled. Now, children, see here, 3 and 7. Children, look at here, see. Compare these two numbers, which is the big number and which is the small number. Children, how can you find this one? Yes. See, children, where is the number 3? Here. And number 7? Here. In these two numbers, which number came first? Yes, number 3. After that, number 7. Right? So, which number coming after that? That only big number. Okay, children? See. 
we compare these two numbers. Where is 7? Here. And where is number 3? Here. So, children, number 7 comes always number 3. After that. Okay? Number 7 comes always after number 3. So, so number 7 is a big number. Okay, children? For example, I have three balls and I have seven circles. See, here three balls and here one, two, three, four, five, six, seven circles. Now, children, tell me. Compare these two numbers. Which is the big number? Seven. How can you find? See. More than four circles. More. Right? Compare these number. Okay? So, number seven always comes after number three. And children, one more example. Here, we have two balls. Okay, children? In this ball, see, first ball, I filled with stars. And second ball, I filled with flowers. Okay, children? Shall we start counting? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. Children, in this ball only nine stars. Okay, children? Next. In the second ball, how many flowers? Shall we count? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. How many flowers? Totally fifteen. Children, first of all, we have two balls. First ball, I filled with stars. And in the second ball, I filled with flowers. In the first ball, how many stars we have? Only nine. In the second ball, how many flowers? Yes, only fifteen. Now, children, we have to find which is the big number and which is the small number. Which is the big number and which is the small number. How can you find this one? Yes. See. Children. 9. Where is the 9 here? Yes. 9 is here. Right? And 15 number. Where is the 15? 9 after 10, 11, 12, 12 after 13, 14, 15. 15 is here. Right? So, See, children, 9 and 15. Children, 15 number always comes after 9. Right? So, 15 is a big number. 15 is a big number. And 9, small number. 9 is a small number. Children, here, one more thing. This is single digit. This is two digit. Right? This is one digit number. This one is two digit number. So, now we have to find two digit number is always bigger than one digit number. Okay, children? So, today we are to go and discuss about comparison of numbers. What is the topic today? Comparison of numbers. See. Comparison of numbers. Okay, children. In this topic, first one is greater than. First one is 
greater than greater than or bigger than second one is this is first one second one is less than or smaller than third one is equal to equal to okay children now these have symbols also okay first we have to discuss greater than or bigger than okay children now children first of all greater than or bigger than now children here we have two objects that is building blocks and cars so how many building blocks here shall we start counting 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 totally 8 so 8 next how many cars 1 2 3 4 5 we have 5 cars yes children now children now we have to find which is the bigger than which is the bigger than tell me children which is a bigger number 8 and 5 we have to compare these two numbers which is the big number yes 8 is a big number right 8 comes after number 5 that's why 8 is a bigger number so now we have to show the symbol c what is this greater than what is the symbol of greater than see children greater than always showing two dots from left side only see this is the right side and this is left side right so greater than two dots these two dots always showing left side okay this is a big number and one more example children here see left side and right side we have earbuds right side this is right side this is left side right so left side and right side how many earbuds we have first count it bundle of earbuds bundle of earbuds means we have to first of all in this bundle only 10 right check it once 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so 10 and how many left 11 12 13 and 14 totally we have 14 earbuds and 14 earbuds see okay children for left side how many birds earbuds shall we count now in this bundle how many is only tens one two three four five six seven eight nine ten yes in the previous class i told already right in the bundle only 10 things see first 10 how many left 11 
ट्वेल्व थर्टीन फोर्टीन फिफ्टीन सिक्सटीन सेवेंटीन एंड एटीन सो चिल्ड्रन एटीन राइट नाउ वी केयरफुल चिल्ड्रन हियर राइट साइड ओनली वी हैव फोर्टीन इयरबड्स एंड लेफ्ट साइड ओनली वी हैव एटीन इयरबड्स नाउ चिल्ड्रन टेल मी कंपेयर दीज टू नंबर्स विच इज द बिगर नंबर टेल मी चिल्ड्रन विच इज द बिगर नंबर येस एटीन इज ए बिगर नंबर वाई बिकॉज एटीन always comes after फोर्टीन after फोर्टीन that's why एटीन is a bigger number now we have to show symbol what is the symbol this one this is bigger number or greater than symbol okay children yes now I told right these two dots always shown left side okay 18 number is a big number which side is this this is left side right so i have to show this one left side only see okay children so now children some examples see 40 and 50 see we have two numbers right left side is 14 and right side is 15 now tell me children it is the big number 14 or 15 yes so for 15 is a big number right but is this left side or right side right side okay now which symbol came this is the greater than just now i told see be careful children greater than always left side number it is for example it is bigger than then we have to show this symbol but here left side is a small number is there right now we have to mention less than okay children so don't confuse now one more example 24 and 18 now tell me children we have 24 and 18 which is the big number 24 or 18 which is a big number yes 24 is a big number why because 24 comes always after number 18 so this is a big number this big number which side is there is a left side a right side yes left side so yes yes so this is which symbol greater than now see greater than this one okay children 24 greater than 18 it is very easy and one more example 50 38 okay now tell me children now we have to compare these two numbers which is the greater than or which is the bigger than tell me children see here 50 and here 38 yes so 50 is a big number or small number yes big number so now we have to show the symbol it is that this is symbol of greater than this is symbol of greater than okay children now children less than or smaller than see children we have pens and markers right side we have pens and left side we have 
markers. Okay, children. Shall we count? One, two, three, four. We have only four markers. Now, how many pens? One, two, three, four, five, six. We have six pens. Now, children, now we have to compare these two numbers. Which is the smaller number? Which is the smaller number? Why? Because we have to discuss about only less than. Less than means smaller number. Okay, children. Now, 4 and 6. Yes? So, which is the smaller number? Yes. Here, 4, small number. Why? Because 4 number always comes before number 6. Before number 6. So, 4 is a small number. Right? Now, we have to show the symbol of Less than. See. We have to show the symbol of less than. Okay, children. One more example. Now, children, one more example. Here, we have some sketches. And here, we have some pencils. Children, right side, we have pencils. And left side, we have sketches. Right? Now, Shall we count? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So, totally we have 11 sketches. Next, how many pencils? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So, we have 20 pencils. So, C. Now, children, now we compare these two numbers, which is the smaller number, 20 or 11. Which is the smaller number? Yes, 11 is a smaller number, right? Why? Because 11 comes always number 20, before 20, before, okay? Before means back side. So, 11 is a small number. Now, we have to show symbol of smaller than or less than. See, children. Okay, children. This is symbol of less than. Compare these two numbers. Which is a small number? 11. So, that's why we have to show on less than. See, left side, if for example, uh, before that, we discussed already. Greater above the greater than, right? Left side is a uh, big number. Then we have to show on greater than. But here is small number is there. Now, we show less than. Okay, children? Left side, small number is there. Not a big number. That's why we have to show on only less than. For example, left side we have big number is there. Then we have to show on greater than. Okay, children? It is very simple. Now, children, here we will see some examples. Now, 17 and 32. Now, children tell me here 17 and 32 numbers we have. Which number is the small number? Tell me children. Which number is the small number? 17 or 32? Which one? Yes. 
17 is a small number. Why? Because 17 comes always before number 32. Before number 32, not next. Before means back side. So, 17 is a small number. Then we have to show smaller than means less than. See, children, one more example. 25 and 68. We have here 25 and 68. Now, children, we have to find which is the smaller number. Means which is the less than number. Tell me, children. Yes. 25 is a smaller number. Means 25 always comes before number 68. Okay, children. Then we have to show one symbol of less than. What is this? Symbol of less than. See, children, this is the less than symbol, right? Now, here greater than. For example, 73 and 42. See, in these two numbers, now we have to compare which number is the greater than. Means, which is the bigger than number? Which number is the bigger than? Yes, 73. Then we have to show greater than. Right? And one more example. See. 10 and 5. We have two numbers. 10 and 5. Compare these two numbers. Which is the bigger one? 10. Then we have to show greater than. Children here don't confuse. Here greater than, here less than is there. So don't confuse. Simple logic. See, left side. This is right side numbers, right? This is right side numbers. These are left side numbers. These are left. These are right. Then children compare the left side numbers only. I'm talking about left side numbers, not right side. Left side number compared to right side number is it bigger than? Then we have to show greater than. Otherwise, we have to compare these two numbers. Left number always small number is there. Then we have to show less than number. Okay, children, it is very Simple. Don't confuse. Now, children, compare the numbers using greater than or less than. Here, some examples. Okay, children? Now, see. Here, first one, 8 and 3. Now, tell me, children, compare these two numbers. Which symbol came in? Greater than or less than? Which one? How can you compare that one? Yes. See. You compare always left side number. First. Okay, children? So, what is the number? 8. And this one? 3. So, 8 compared to this one, 3 number. Is a bigger number or smaller number? Yes. This is big number compared to this number. Okay. So, 8 comes always number after 8. Number 3. Right. Then, how to show the symbol? Greater than. Okay, children. See here. We have to these two numbers comparing. First, we have to compare 8 number, 3 number. 
So, which is the bigger one? Eight is the big number, right? Why? Because eight always comes after number three. So, eight is a bigger number. So, now we have to show what is the symbol? Yes. Left side is a bigger number, is there no? That's why you have to show these two dots. That means this is greater than. This is greater than. And one more example. See, here 7 and 11. 7 and 11. Now, children, compare this number to this number. Right? 7 is a big number or a smaller number compared to 11. Tell me children. 7 compared to this number is a bigger number or smaller number? Yes. Smaller number. Right? Means 7 number comes always before 11. Before. Okay? So, this is a smaller number. Right? Smaller number. So, we have shown symbol of less than. Okay, children? Now, see. And one more example here. 13 and here 9. Now, children, here simple logic. This is a single digit number and this is a double digit number. Right? Double digit number always bigger than one digit number. Right? We are using like that only. Here also. Here two digit number, here one digit number. So, which is a big number? This is. This one is a big number. Then, we have to show only greater than. Means, two digit number or double digit number always bigger than one digit number. Okay, children? Now, this is a rule number one. What is that rule number one? Rule number one, double digit number is always bigger than one digit number. Okay, children? Next, here, see, 15 and 12. 15 and 12. Which is the big number? Yes, 15 is a big number. So, now we have to show only greater than. Yes? And see. Next example. 35 and 68. 35 and 68. Which is the big number? Okay. Sometimes we don't know which is a big number. Don't confuse. Here. Be careful. First, when we have both two digit number, this is two digit number, this one also two digit number, right? In that time, first we have to compare only tens numbers. This is ones, this is tens, right? This is ones, this is tens. In this time, we have to compare only ten tens numbers only. Okay? It's very easy. See, what is a ten number? Three. Here tens number? Six. Three. Now, tell me, if this is a big number? Three or six? Yes. Six is a big number, right? Three is a small number. So, three is a small number. That's why 35 also small number. Smaller number. So, then we have to show, what is this? Less than. What is this? Less than. See, children. One more example. 97 and 43. This one also, we have both sides. Two digit numbers. Right? First, ones, tens. Ones, tens. In this time, first we have to compare tens 
place numbers right here nine here four so now tell me children which is a big number nine or four yes nine is a big number that's why 97 also big number then we have shown greater than okay children this is rule number two what is the rule number two when we have both sides two digit numbers in the time first we have to compare ten space numbers okay children next see here 58 and 24 here 58 and 24 here also we have two digit numbers right first we mention ones tens ones tens right then what is the rule number two we compare only tens place numbers right here five and here two which is the big number five and two we have to compare these two numbers only tens place numbers okay so, it is a big number, number 5. 5 is a big number. Also, it is a big number, totally 58. So, what is this? Greater than or less than? Greater than. Right, children? Next. Here, one more example. 43 and 48. 43 and 48. Children, I have small doubt here. See, here I told, first, when we have both side numbers, two digit numbers, first we have to compare 10 place numbers, right? But here, tens place, see, ones, tens, ones, tens. Here, tens numbers are both are same, right? Then, we have to compare ones place numbers. Okay? Tens place numbers when same numbers we have. Then compare only ones place numbers. Okay children? Now, what is the ones place numbers? Here 3, here 8. Now tell me children, which is a big number? 3 or 8? Which is a bigger one? Yes. 8 is a bigger number. So, bigger, I am showing. This is a bigger number now. So, two dots here by itself. This is a smaller number, right? Okay. Now, here one more example. 70 and 79. Here also same number. See, 70 and 79. First, we mention place values. Ones, tens. Ones, tens. Right? First, we have to compare tens place numbers. Both are same. Right? Then, we have to compare ones place numbers. Right? Here, zero. Here, nine. Now, tell me, children, which is a bigger number? Yes. Nine is a bigger number. Zero means nothing. Right? So, we have to mention less than. Right? Next. Here, we have two, two numbers. And also, same tens place numbers. 8 and 8. Then, we have to compare only ones place numbers. So, here 9, here 4. Which is a big number? Nine. So, this is a big number. Right? This is very easy. Right? Are you understood? This is rule number three. What is the rule number three? When we have to tens place numbers are equal, then we have to compare only ones place 
numbers. Okay, children. So we have three rules, right? What is the rule number one? Two digit number always bigger than one digit number. Okay, children. Next rule number two. We have two digit numbers both sides. For example, ones, tens. Ones, tens. Then we have to compare first of all tens place numbers. Okay, children. Next rule number three. We have both sides two digit numbers as well as same numbers, tens place numbers. Then we have to compare only one space numbers. Okay, children. It's very easy. Okay, children. Now, third one, equal to, equal to, symbol of this one. Okay, children, now, see, first of all, for example, I have four balls and I have four triangles. Right side four triangles and left side four balls. Both sides are same number. Right? Then we have to mention equal. This is the symbol of equal to. This is the symbol of equal to. Okay children? See. When we have to both sides same numbers then we have to mention symbol of equal to. Okay, children? One more example. 9 dash 9. Tell me, children. Right side 9 number and left side also 9 number. Both sides numbers same. Then we have to mention equal to. Okay, children? Next. 80 dash 80. See, left side and right side, we have same numbers. So, these are left side number and right side number, both are equal. Now, we have to show the symbol equal to. What is this? Equal to. Okay, children. Now, today, we will learn greater than, less than and equal to. I think everyone will start, right? Okay. Thank you.